We're monitoring a variety of breaking issues as we start a new week, such as the last-minute campaign for votes in. The risky game we do want to start with that state of emergency in North Carolina where tens of thousands are still without power and schools will be closed for a second day after numerous power. Facilities came under assault, along with the terrible story of a small girl taken from her own front yard. The FBI is now engaged in the probe as the power company says it might take days before energy is fully restored, according to officials who claim someone or a group seems to have deliberately attacked the grid with gunshots. North Carolina Good evening, Mark. Nora and the surrounding neighborhood are unsure of the perpetrators of this attack, and it may take until Thursday for the main utility to restore power. What took place here in the middle of North Carolina on Saturday night, there was a violent and deliberate attack. Someone opened fire on two power substations, damaging vital utility equipment and plunging Moore County into catastrophe. Uncertainty surrounds who and why, but the effects were evident. Like with these traffic signals, in Carthage, North Carolina. This is not what I intended to be doing today, last night, or the night before, stringing electricity lines and eating cold ham, in Steve and Meg Wilkins' unheated house at 55 degrees. Earlier this year, the U.S. had over 55,000 substations, and news had received a report from the Department of Homeland Security in January warning that domestic violent extremists continue to devise plausible detailed plots to target power infrastructure. The way Moore County looks today, I can assure you to the perpetrators out there that we will find you for now this attack is not considered domestic terrorism but people here are apprehensive. 60 Minutes profiled how lightly protected and vulnerable they frequently are. It turns out that taking out fewer than 20 critical substations all at once could black out the entire country. Difficult predicament. If you loved the video please hit a like button and don't forget to subscribe the channel.